Pick his nose! No, my teeth, no! Don't let her do it! Why would you? Why? <laughs> What are they? I think it's the same That's woman. Oh. But he's done her at different positions, angles, whatever you want to say. It's yeah. like how we take like 20 photos and just pick one to she's put yeah. on our Instagram. She's my favorite. She just has that. Like, All right, come on, are we done with this yet? Yeah. She kind of looks like an oil rig. <laughs> Something about the neck. I don't think they had a back then. No. That's for Papa. Mm-hmm. Oh, so yeah. Papa wants to be your Francis Bacon. <laughs> he looks like he was in a dark place. I was gonna say, like her neck's all squeezed, and it looks like a guillotine down there. This yeah, might have been yeah. somebody he had a fight with, you know? No, I didn't see the It's a chair with Yeah, but is it? It looks like a pin. <laughs> I still think like somebody had thing. an argument right before he painted this. <laughs> I see a guillotine now. Yeah. Hmm. Well, that looks like a sword. Mm -hmm. like a stabbing oh, action. Yeah. 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 And that looks like a little person down there. There's like yeah. some little smoke little going smoke. up. Yeah. yeah. Like what? Yeah. This one just has a big old bubbly butt being spanked. All I see up here in this is a bird <laughs> that has hit a window. Uh, a bird yeah. that hit a window, I see that. I just, yeah, I see masochism right, here. Uh, I, see the, I see the butt, like it's getting branded. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, branding's probably more the case, yeah. <laughs> Where the window looks broken here, and you see like the paint. Well, there's a bird, yeah, you see the bird, yeah. Is it? <laughs> this is probably the best part of your job, I'm gonna listen to. <laughs> What's the best thing you've heard about this one? Uh, I haven't really heard anyone talk about this, and they kind of ignore it. They're just like, really? A lot of people don't like, understand it, so they're just like, okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> it looks like one of those iron things. Uh, like, what are those things like in old movies that they always drop on people or something? Do you know what I'm talking about? Yes, and I can't think of the I name of what you're talking they about. Do what to like, people? They're, like, they drop them like, in some of the old. Anvil? Yeah. Anvil? Uh, is that what it is? An anvil? Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's not like an iron board, no. Not, no. Like an, uh, yeah. Like but it turns usually be like this way. Mm -hmm. Oh, I know what you're talking about. Okay. Is that an anvil? Yeah. Well, yeah, and see, this kind of looks like an anvil as well. This whole yeah. thing. Some sort of like. Well, that. Maybe a horse tie down, but. Well, I thought that was a pot. Like, so well, it does look like a pot, like a, like yeah, in the like a mug place. or something. <laughs> the whole thing, like, to me, looks like he wanted to have a garage sale or just, like, break all of his shit and throw it away. <laughs> He's, like, sick of all his crap. Artists, you know how they are. <laughs> I love that one. Fruit dish. So, yeah, there's more than one. Doesn't say what kind of just... Nobody else could figure it out. They argued like this. Yeah, because like that might be a pear, like right there. Peaches. Uh, and one grape. That's what we're saying. Oh, like Peaches, three, three some grapes. grapes. Yeah. And some apples in there. Well, there's a, a clove of garlic up there in the background. I'm trying to grow some garlic. Are you? Garlic's the best. I did. I, did, I bought with the cats when I first started the garden this year. That'll happen. What'd you do so to get rid of them? Plant catnip in your neighbor's garden? No. <laughs> Plastic forks. Oh, really? They don't like it? They'll step on it and they don't like it? They don't like it. Huh. Took a lot of them, but it seems That's really work. smart, actually. It seemed to work. Yeah. But I don't know if it's so the birds and squirrels. Is that a Start getting into my cantaloupes. I don't know. I don't know. Oh. So, you know that big containers of strawberries, or even the smaller ones that you size Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, until they get too big, you oh, close them in there and they can't eat them. Uh, like I've learned all sorts of things like being off on um, yeah. Pinterest this week. Yeah. Oops. 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 Like yeah. yeah. I didn't think about, you caged it up, I mean. Yeah. yeah. That's cool. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. And it was like, I need to figure a way to cage the, so I think, Oh, the, but it's hard to cage the tomatoes the unless I mm. make them yeah. this way. Right. I was thinking, oh, 
Oh, was it the dollar store? Well, and they so, have that. They're supposed to be laundry bags. Yeah. So this right. Is like but why couldn't I use it? Because it's still airy. Mm -hmm. Over at tomato cage to keep the birds from eating my tomatoes constantly. Yeah. So I'm learning. On things. I have full faith that you'll figure it out. I thought, okay. I went to get some garlic the other day, and two of them had sprouted, so I thought, let's stick them in the dirt and see what happens. <laughs> I mean, I grew celery that way. Yeah. And your green onions, if you don't, if you just take the green off and leave some of the white, and just stick them in some water, they will re-sprout re the green. Yeah. Hell yeah. And then I took the celery and cut the bottom off and just stuck it out there, in, and I had more celery. And then I took um, some lettuce and cut the bottom off, and I had lettuce Yeah. Too. It's surprising what you can take and do with stuff. It's like the original recycling. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I do put all my scraps and do composting. I do do that. Yeah. I mean, it was just neat to try these little things that I've learned on Pinterest. To, did you know that about your green onions? If you'll keep the white part and stick it in water, it'll, it'll sprout the green. <laughs> it'll sprout the That's straight up porn right there. Yeah, it is. It'll sprout the green again, Marie. Backwards. Yeah, that is straight up hard. Mm -hmm. Did you guys go downstairs just to go upstairs? Aren't we going back up to the top? Oh, I forgot. Yeah. No, I'm talking about the roof. The roof. We're here. I still have an open tab, so. <laughs> I totally forgot. <laughs> Where's everybody want to go? Oh. Uh, London, Italy, <laughs> Japan. <laughs> I'm feeling really inspired, I'd like to go to Morocco. Yeah, Morocco, that'd be nice. That's interesting, why not? Yeah, let's go find that lady friend for you. Yeah. Yeah, the Algerian women are the, yeah. You know, to be honest, I'd like to see an actual photograph of them first, because, uh... <laughs> well, they're probably dead. I know artists. That was wait, like wait, wait, really this is number two. Is that true? Ladies. Considering that was early night. Back up to Iowa, see my sister, over to see friends in Denver, and then down to uh, oh. Arizona, California. Yeah. Denver should be good. You get a good 70s guitar. I was there last Christmas. Ah. The snow. Because each decade has their own guitar sound. See, in the 1930s, when the 40s, yeah, let's sit on this side because there's shade. No guitar okay. effects whatsoever. Okay. What'd you say? I'm gonna need to get home. Okay. All right. So oh. I don't know if you want her to take you home. Or if you want. Uh, I can actually, I can Uber. That's fine. No. Then in the 1950s, they got a uh, delay, so you had rockabilly, so you had. Here, let's get yeah, let's get that bar table. My curls grow out, that happens to me nearly every day. <laughs> I just love the curls. <laughs> My mom's a character, huh? I like your mom. Thanks. Bye, Matisse. She's very funky. Yeah, she is. And uh, again, I was serious. I was like, oh, I see where you get it. Uh, yeah, I think I do. I, 